Sure. So Malaysia gets uh, UFC fighters stopping by here, but we never really have any fights here. I mean, we get fights in Singapore, mm -hmm. but why do you think that is? You know, I think the sport is still growing here. Uh, I think it's still, you know, the more that it's being exposed and, and people start to understand it more, uh, then it, the bigger that it will become. You know, it it happened in, in the U.S. too. You know, it, it was no different. I think it's just, I think it's just the timing uh, of it. You know, it's so big in the U.S. now that you look at, at Asia and you say it's small, but really it's, it's, it's growing. It's in its infancy. It's still as it should be. Uh, you know, the sport's still new. The, the sport is still being figured out, you know, even when I when I first was exposed to it, I thought it was just, you know, barroom brawlers and, and you know, they, they're just getting in there and it's two men just fighting to the death. But really, when you look at it and the more you get exposed to it, the more you see like there's so much strategy, there's so much technique, there's so much uh, intelligence that goes into it uh, that you really grow a deeper level of respect for the for the game. Uh, and, and I feel like that eventually that will come is just the UFC is only 25 years old um, and even younger here in Asia. The more the more that they, they bring these events over here, the bigger it'll be and um, the more you'll see high level fighters and, and people will really respect that. I mean, you're aware that we have something called one championship right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like an Asia kind of thing. Yeah, and, and, and I know it's huge in Asia. Uh, but again, you, you look at the level of, of fighter and it, it's just it's just different. Like that's just a harsh reality. It's different compared to you know the the top uh, the top level in the UFC. You know when you when you see a a, a really talented uh, fighter in, in the UFC, you can and you've done it before and you respect the game. You can understand you know how difficult it is to pull off those moves against another high level guy at that speed. Uh, with all that that pressure behind them and everything, and you just don't see that in other promotions uh, because they aren't the best fighters in the world. Okay, so sometime last year, one championship actually expressed the interest to collaborate with the USC, but the USC said that one championship is not at that level. I mean, you feel the same way, but what are your thoughts? I mean, going by whatever you just said. You you know the the UFC uh, the way they run their business is is on them. You know they, they're the best promotion in the world for a reason. I think uh, you know it would be, it would be stupid for me even to to tell them how to how to run the business. Um, I feel like collaborations are always good, um, but again, the, really, what you want to see is the crossover. And I feel the bigger the sports gets, uh, the more talent that you'll see come up, and the bigger that every other organization or organization gets. You know, it, competition, you know. Uh, a rising, what they say, a rising sea like raises all ships. Like the competition will just be good for all of us. Uh, so the bigger that one FC gets, the more talented fighters that they'll get, and the, and the more uh, the people that come to these events will will really start to understand and appreciate the game.